Life doesn't always give you what you want. Today is a pretty good example of it and I will tell you why. One of the many reasons why we are in Kiev right now is that we're shooting a new series for Playboy. And we wanted to kind of do some branding for ourselves while we are in these videos. You know, it's pretty good to get your name out there. That's why we are here in the sprint shop to kind of not have random logos on our t-shirts anymore, but just a t-shirt with our own brand on it. But then this happened. Yes, Jonah him. JC, what happened, man? I have a sad smiley. This is the one we want. It's the one. Show the tattoo, JC. It's a tattoo. Should be like this. But for JC, it turned out like this. JC and me have the same tattoo and it's turned it from upside down and I will tell you now what it means. Even if you're the luckiest guy, girl, person in the world, you can't avoid bad things happening to you and you can't control it. But what you do can control is the fact how you react to it, how your perspective on the situation is and just how you deal with it in general. This tattoo is a constant reminder to reframe your mind into thinking about a positive thing instead of the negative aspect about the situation. Because even if the situation is really negative, for example this one, I don't really see a positive thing about it happening. Still, let's say it's just pretty funny. That might be the one thing that you enjoy about it. Just thinking like, you know what, it's actually a pretty funny mistake. <laughs> it's a little bit screwed up because you want a happy smiley, not a sad one. But either way, it's a little bit funny, so that's how I'm gonna think about it. Because being sad about it, it's not going to change it. It's not gonna turn the frown upside down in real life on the print right now. It's not going to do anything. But how you think about it, that's the only thing you can control. And that actually will change something about your evening. Whether you'll be crying in a corner like a little girl, or that you will still have a good night. I will maybe encounter some other positive things. Because let's say if you are in this corner crying like a little girl, chances are pretty low that things will turn around. But if you go out, go somewhere, work, whatever, you might still have a good night and maybe even completely turning your mood around. So don't let the little negative things get to you. Control them with your mind. Keep moving forward. Other positive things will come in your path and just keep going forward, whatever you're doing. JC! Yes, Let me Jonah. know your thoughts about the situation. I don't feel that much, to be honest. It's, it was just hilarious. The tattoo, which kind of could be a symbol for a sad or happy face, turned out sad on mine and happy on yours. It's kind of just hilarious. The guy who printed it wasn't sure about it either. Maybe he had a bad first part of the day and a good second part of the day. I don't know, but it's just hilarious. That's what it symbolizes. Turn the frown upside down, that's what they're gonna do for the next t-shirt, hopefully tomorrow. Maybe it's easy for me to say because it was JC's shirt that got screwed up, not mine. Anyway, see you guys tomorrow where I will show you a boring day in the life of a videographer. Not the cool parts, not the shooting asses, but the part that you don't wanna see, the part where you're dreaming about this life and thinking like, fuck, why does my life suck? Well, you know what? Maybe tomorrow you will think your life is way better than mine. So see you guys tomorrow.